Travis. Forgive your big brother who was too much of a shite bag to thank you face to face. You're the big brother? <laughs> You're How do you know I didn't pop out, out which first? Which one of us popped out first? And the point is, there's no honor in getting rescued by my younger, big <sighs> brother. So I took it upon myself to proper kill Scott Gardner, Greg Cantrell, and Massimo Bellini. You've got to so be kidding me. Would you fifth. fucking people and stop no stealing my me. kills? This makes us even, as far as the rescue goes. You and I still have a score to box off, but that's another subject entirely. So don't get yourself killed till we have a chance to finish our fight. Damn it, Irish ass. He could at least have told me more about those assassins. And in case you were wondering, oh, I took pictures of the three skangers as souvenirs. How long is this You'll message? Just have to drool over them, because there's no way you can play through these fights. The game's stuffed full as it is. Picks came out nice, though. They probably make good wallpaper for your cell. Well, I'm out of things to say, so I'll hang up now. Hmm. Long message, isn't it? Hello? Travis, it's me. I have arranged the next fight. Come to my office. Gotcha. Um, uh, <laughs> hi. Uh, can I call you Travis the Great? Travis Ravenous? Cool hand, teasy greasy. <laughs> um, I'm sorry, I, uh, 
I've always been a fan. What? A fan? Of me? <laughs> yes! <laughs> I watched your fight with Charlie, too. Oh, you were hardcore. So cool. Oh, no. Oh, I feel really nervous. I think I'm gonna puke. OMG, I bet you hate girls who puke. Uh, never really thought about it. <laughs> Don't stare at me. You're staring at me. If you get me preggers, promise you won't ditch me, okay? <laughs> anyway, I wrote down all my feelings in a letter. Here, take it. Your, uh, feelings? So this is a love letter? Take it, take it, or I'll totally die. Okay, thanks. I could use a dose of innocence. That last fight got a little sick, even for me. <laughs> um, aren't you gonna read it? Huh? Read it? Now? Here? Yes! You have to read it out loud, just for lulls. I wrote a song dedicated to Travis the Great, so you read and I'll play it on my flute, okay? You're... you're joking, right? Read this here? Here we go. Get into it. To my dearest Travis the Great. Hi there, Travis the Great. I am the girl who loves you the most in the entire world. But in order to prove that I'm your number one fan, I need some kind of evidence. Because no matter how much I insist that I'm your number one, any other chick or bitch can approach you and say the exact same thing. That is why I've decided that I should become strong. By doing so, I knew that someday I'd be able to get closer to you. Putting my title as Travis the Great's number one fan on the line, I embarked on this path and ended up winning the National Student Assassin Championship. I really did my best. But you know, in hindsight, it was a cinch. I guess I'm just blessed. I could master in one day techniques that would take others years to do. Pretty awesome, right? And then I got greedy, a new urge, a vision, that just maybe I could win a fight against Travis the Great. Now my goal is to behead Travis the Great, therefore surpassing my hero. Oops, did I actually write that? It's kind of embarrassing, you know. Well, anyways, I've made up my mind. I made an oath. I won't be killed by anyone. I shall defeat Travis the Great in battle. Only then will Travis the Great become mine and mine only. Love, Travis the Great's number one fan, Kimmy Howell. Okay, so much for the dose of innocence. But you've got the bloodlust. I'm sure about that. Yeah, I'm legit and way tougher than I look. So, uh, don't hold back, okay? Because one mistake is all over. This is for real. <laughs> if you're trying to give me a headache, it's working. Now it's lesson time. Here we go. Get into it. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> 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 
Consequences, sweetheart. Travis the Great. Screw this. I can't kill a co-ed. Come see me after you graduate, and I'll school you again. <laughs> 